Hello everyone and welcome to the 2010 NBA tournament. We're in round two, game set three. This is the first game of the game set three. And the Denver Nuggets 2-0 visit the Golden State Warriors 0-2. And as you can see from the score there, it's a scoring fest at 106-102. So let's get down to the court side and it's going to be Golden State who will put the ball into play and the ball is going to be with Reggie Williams 6-3 and straight away Carmelo Anthony picks up his fourth foul of the game and Reggie will go to the line for two 61-1 Gets the first one, that's three of three from the free throw line. Here comes the second one. And he makes that one two. So four of four from the free throw line and the lead is now just down to two. Denver trying to keep their unbeaten record. And really in this situation we'll probably secure their position in the third round although it's not going to be guaranteed Carmelo Anthony has the ball and he makes a great pass over to Hilario who gets the two and the four point lead is re-established by Denver Corey Maggett has the ball for Golden State 5-4 and is he going to pass? No, he's going to try and one on one and drives in and shoots and misses. Offensive centre, defensive centre, and Hilario picks up the defensive rebound, his sixth of the game. Denver with the ball, and Hilario is going to have it. 4 2 is going to be possible steal by the shooting guard, Roger Bell. And he's got a four, and he will steal, so. Hilario with his second turnover, Roger Bell with his fourth steal and they'll build from the back, Steph Curry has the ball, 4-5, he's going to look for a three point attempt, 34-4 and he gets the three Steph Curry hitting the big three and bringing them within one. Great pass from Raja Bell gets his third assist. 11 minutes remaining in this game and Denver have it with Chauncey Billups. 5-3. He's going to look for a great pass over to Kenyon Martin who's a 35-5-4 becomes a 45-4. And he makes that easy basket from the pass from Billups. Nine assists now for Chauncey Billups. <clears throat> 110 to 107. And the ball is going to be with Corey Meggett for Golden State. 2 6 is going to be a shot and a miss. Offensive shooting guard plus two is a six. Defensive shooting guard seven. So a flalo. Aaron Aflalo gets his fifth defensive rebound. And Denver come up the court and it's going to be with Carmelo Anthony. 5-4 looking to pass. But he notices a, a chance of a one-on-one -on -one and he tries to drive in but misses. And he will become fatigued, he will become cold. Offensive power forward is an 11 defensive power forward plus two. So Corey Meggett takes the defensive rebound, his second of the game. And Golden State have the ball. And it's with Beardrins, the centre. 4 5 is going to be an offensive foul by, by Beardrins. That's his second offensive foul of the game and he's only had two so they've both been offensive fouls. So sideline ball 
to Denver and Chauncey Bullock uh, sorry Carmelo Anthony has the ball 5-2 looking for a great pass over to Kenyon Martin 45-4 and Martin misses Defensive power forward is 17 defensive power forward so Kenyon Martin gets the offensive rebound and he's going to be fouled by Corey Meggett Meggett's fourth foul of the game and he'll go to the line so Kenyon Martin on 42 gets the first one that's three of four today Lines up gets the second one four of five so 112 107 to Denver and Golden State with 10 minutes remaining will come up the court ball is with Corey Mega 5-1 is gonna get a great pass over to shooting guard Roger Bell and Bell drains the ball just a one score in it Carmelo Anthony for Denver 4-6 he's gonna look for a pass one the ball will end up with Nene Hilario 5-3 pass two and that will go back to, Corey, to Carmelo Anthony and 4-4 four, four. it's gonna step on the line and turn the ball over Golden State with Corey Meggett 6-3 he's going to be fouled by Kenyon Martin that's the fourth foul by Martin second team foul in this period and Meggett will go to the line 56 gets the first one 6-6 six of six from the free throw line today sets up and the second one is on the way and he'll get that too so seven of seven just one point in this game and Anthony Carter and Monta Ellis will now <coughs> be available and they are the last two players that needed time to rest the ball is with Hilario for Denver one point lead two three gets the easy two no assist on that and so 1-1-4-1-0-1-1-1 Reggie Williams has the ball for Golden State 1-4 easy two for Williams keeping the game within one point and no assist there either Carmelo Anthony has the ball one six and he's going to pass one sorry one six is not possible score he'll miss and offensive rated 12 no so Beardrins gets the defensive rebound and Golden State take the timeout and Monte Ellis comes in for Raja Bell ball is with Reggie Williams 5-1 great pass over to center Beardrins who drains the easy two Reggie Williams gets his fourth assist and Golden State will take the lead in the game 1-1-4 1-1-5 unbeaten Denver trailing by one point against winless Golden State Carmelo Anthony 5-6 he's gonna look for a pass but he's gonna drive to the basket instead and he's gonna miss it that's six in a row now Anthony's missed and the power forward Corey Maggot gets his third defensive rebound are they gonna try for a fast break yes they are And it's going to end up with Maggot. These are both 
green so three is going to be a possible fast break shot and he will get a fast break shot 43 and he misses it three misses in a row for Megat and highest rebounder defensive small forward defensive shooting guard so Carmelo Anthony picking up his fifth defensive rebound eight minutes remaining and the ball is with the centre, Hilario for Denver, trailing by one. 3 5 and an easy two for Hilario. Gives them back the lead. Point guard Chauncey Billups gets his tenth assist. So gets his double double. And Cora Megat comes up the court for Golden State. 3 2. Possible block by Kenyon Martin. But no, Megat gets it over him. Puts it into the basket. Steph Curry gets the assist, his eighth of the game. And again, the lead changes back to Golden State. I think really that Denver were expecting this to be an easy win and it really should be but they've struggled to get away and that's going to be Chauncey Billups being fouled by Steph Curry third foul by Steph Curry of the game second for Steph Curry Billups will go to the line 62-4 and makes that first one easily 7 of 7 Tying the score at 117. Second one on the way. And he makes that one too. Certainly wiped its feet but went in. And that will give the lead back to Denver. So, Golden State with the ball in the hands of Reggie Williams. 118-117, 2-1, gets the easy two and they will again. It says topsy-turvy game, swapping the lead. <coughs> 119, 118 and the ball is with Billups for Denver. 3-1, is he gonna get blocked? No, he isn't, so he's going to make that easy basket. And yet another lead change, and Kenyon Martin will also get an assist, which will be his first of the game. 120, 119, seven minutes remaining. And the ball is going to be with Monte Ellis back on court after his rest. 5 3 is going to look. For a pass, I'm gonna get it over to Corey Maggot. Four four. Is it gonna be stolen? He is. So Maggot turns the ball over. His fourth turnover. Kenyon Martin with the steal. Do they want a fast break? No. They're gonna build up from the back and get it out to Hilario. Pass one. <coughs> Over to Carmelo Anthony. And he steps back to look for a three. They're on a plus one from Golden State. So 26 becomes 31. And Anthony misses again. Offensive small forward plus three. He's going to be 11 against the defensive small forward. So Carmelo Anthony gets the offensive rebound. Does he want to attempt to call him too short? He does not, and it's a shame really because he could have had <coughs> in the act of shooting if there hadn't been something on that card for the offensive rebound, but he's going to get the ball over to Kenyon Martin. 6-2, and is he fouled? Yes, he is. Corey Meggett with his fifth foul.
So Martin will go to the line 42. Gets the first one. 5 of 6 today. 121, 119. Can he get the second one? No, he can't. He misses the second one. And the rebound. 16. Highest at power forward. Well, the tide, so it will go to the defender, Corey Maggot, for his fourth defensive rebound. Six minutes remaining, halfway through this final period. And Denver leading by one score, 121 to 119. Golden State have the ball with Reggie Williams. 4-5 is going to be a three-point attempt by Williams, 31-5. And he misses it. Offensive centre plus six is 19. So Beardrins gets the offensive rebound. His third of the game. And they look to build. The ball ending up with Corey Maggot. 3-6. Going to shoot and miss. And the defensive small forward, Carmelo Anthony, is going to take the defensive rebound. Are they going to try and fast break? No, they're going to build up. But it will be Anthony, 6-4. Is he fouled by Reggie Williams? He is. Williams is fifth foul of the game. Four team fouls now for Golden State. <coughs> And it's going to be a sideline ball. So they get the ball into Chauncey Billups. 3 5 is going to look for a three point attempt. 33 5. And he misses it. Defensive shooting guard Monta Ellis comes up the court for Golden State. 121 119. And he's going to end up with the ball 5-3 and he's going to look for a three-pointer 31 and he's just going to miss that bounces off ball goes out of bounds who last touched it it's going to be Denver's ball it's defensive team rebound <clears throat> five minutes remaining and Aaron Aflalo has the ball for Denver 5-1 Looks for a great pass over to Hilario and Hilario slam dunks the ball. Two point two score game now. 123, 119. Monte Ellis has the ball for Golden State. 5-4. Looking to pass. <clears throat> but instead he tries to drive. And he misses the layup. Offensive small forward plus four, which is eight. Against the power forward, Kenyon Martin will easily take that for his eighth defensive rebound. <coughs> and Denver coming up the court with a four-point lead. Chauncey Billups. 3-3. Three, three. Is it going to get blocked by Steph Curry? He is, so Billups shoots. Steph Curry gets the blocking. And 56. Defensive centre, which is Beardrins. Rebounds and makes perfect outlap pass to player who goes to coast to coast. And that player is going to be Corey Maggot. So Corey Maggot hits the two off the Beardrins pass. And makes it a two point game. <clears throat> Denver with the ball and Carmelo Anthony. 5-5 five, five is going to be a pass one. Lario with the ball. 2-3. It's going to make the easy two. Keeping the deficit at a two score game. 125-121. That's still four minutes left in this game. Andres Beardrins. One one four is going to shoot and miss, and Kenyon Martin will pick up the D 
defensive rebound is ninth 10 rebounds in the whole game so he's got his double double gets the ball over to Billups 5-4 he's going to be a pass one ends up with Hilario that roll is going to go again 5-5 five, five, pass 2 Mello has the ball for Denver 4-2 is it going to get stolen yes it is so Carmelo Anthony with his third turnover Reggie Williams with his first steal and Golden State trailing 125 121 Corey Meggett comes up to the court 4-5 he's going to turn the ball over he's going to be called for traveling his fifth turnover and not a good time to give one away three minutes remaining in this game Chauncey Phillips with the ball for Denver 2-4 does he want to step out and take a three he does so 35-5 Gotta roll it again. Misses the three. Offensive point guard plus two, which is a four against Steph Curry. Curry takes his third defensive rebound. And Golden State coming up this court. The ball with Monta Ellis. 5 2 is going to be a great pass over to Beardrins. Beardrins gets the easy two Monta Ellis with his fourth assist of the game back to a one score game Denver with Carmelo Anthony 6-4 pass one ball goes round the hole and ends back up with Melo is he gonna get is it gonna be a steal by Ellis yes so Carmelo Anthony with his fourth turnover Monta Ellis his second steal and they're not going to try a fast break they're going to build up and it's going to end up with Steph Curry 125 123 5-5 pass one from Curry two minutes remaining and it's going to end up with Corey Meggett one one five Megat is going to shoot but Hilario is going to put enough pressure on him to make him miss defensive point guard if his rating is eight and it isn't so it's going to be Hilario who will also get the rebound seventh defensive rebound tenth rebound of the game and Carmelo Anthony has the ball for Denver 4-5 going to be a pass one gets it over to Chauncey Billups 1-3 he's going to shoot and miss and Billups is also cold now and we've got a rare play on the rebound so let's see what the rare play chart says 42 offensive point guard Chauncey Billups is grabbed by the defensive shooting guard Monta Ellis as he races to midcourt breakaway foul is called and one shot is awarded if game is fir in first three quarters which it isn't so forget that if game in the fourth or overtime blue die determines a technical foul it's a three so there isn't a technical foul so Monta Ellis picks up the foul and as it's a loose ball foul it says it's one shot but of course they're in the penalty so Billups is going to go to the line for two 63-4 Billups makes the first one all that again and Billups makes the second one One twenty seven, one twenty three, so now it's a two point game, two score game. And Golden State have the ball. It's gonna be with Reggie Williams. 
5 2 is going to get a great pass over to the point guard Steph Curry. 35 to 45, and he misses the two pointer. Offensive small forward plus six gives him 10 against the center. Hilario will take that defensive rebound for Denver. Denver come up the court, and it's going to be with Chauncey Billups. 5 1 is going to be a great pass over to the power forward Kenyon Martin who will slam the ball home and we're down to the last minute now Steph Curry has the ball for Golden State 4-2 he's going to get steal no he's not so pass one that's going to come over to Reggie Williams 2-5 He's going to option of going for a three. He's going to step back and take the three. 31 5. And Reggie Williams is going to miss. Offensive point guard. Three against Billups. Billups will get the defensive rebound and they're going to go for an intentional foul. Forty-four defensive point guard fouls the offensive point guard. So Steph Curry commits the foul. His fourth Billups will go to the line. And he's a sixty-three. So you couldn't pick a worse player to foul. As the game looks like it's coming to an end. Eleven of eleven for Billups. And I think they're going to have to try for a cold three. So we're looking at three on the card of Cora Meggett. And it is not high enough, so it's going to be just a normal play. Four three. Is it going to be stolen? Yes, he is. So Cora Meggett. Sixth turnover, Kenyon Martin with the steal. And again, Golden State are going to try and intentionally foul fourth to 43 this time. And it's defensive point, uh, point guard against the offensive point guard again. So Steph Curry is fifth. And Billups will go to the line again. 52 will be good. 12 of 12 for Billups. And he gets his 13th as well. 133 to 123. And what started off as a close contest in this fourth period has fizzled out five they're looking for a forced called three shooting guard Monte Ellis is a three so he's going to take a, a three-pointer 21 and he's going to miss it power forward seven Hilario will take the defensive rebound and I think they're just going to play this out now they know that the opportunity is gone Carmelo Anthony 2-3 does he want to try a three-pointer no he's going to take the two stops the rot seven shots without points and Chauncey Billups will pick up his 12th assist Referees called over to the side. Yes, they 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 just put the game clock right, and the ball will be taken out to the sidelines. And Carmelo Anthony has 
hands the ball over to the official and Golden State will put the ball in with Steph Curry 4-6 is going to shoot and miss Beardrins will get the offensive rebound does he want to try column two shot he doesn't they're going to look for to spin it out and get the ball to Reggie Williams and Reggie will probably have the last shot of the game 4-1 but will he shooting guard he's looked for a pass and the buzzer goes to end the game and what started off as a really really close game after three periods ends up with Denver staying unbeaten at 3-0 and Golden State will go to 0-3 and, and your final score Denver 1-3-5 Golden State 1-2-3 so let's see if we've got any injuries Carmelo Anthony is a D 56 on a D no injury Chauncey Bullock even blue so no injury Monta Ellis an odd number but 44 on an E so there are no injuries from this game so I hope you've enjoyed this Denver stay 3-0 Golden State go to 0-3 and I hope you join me for the next game in this tournament